Hey guys, this is Brian from North Tampa uh, doing a quick Salesforce training on mobile. Uh, so the um, it's so much easier if you can use your Salesforce right after your calls. Like you get in the car from a hospital, man, just go do it. I know it's a pain and I know it adds a minute, but uh, if you do it right then, trust me, it really beats uh, wait until the end of the week, and then you have two hours of it on a Sunday. That's no good. So um, here's a quick walkthrough on using the mobile app. They had an update last week, and it changed things, and it was not a great change. But I'll show you where everything is, and uh, here we go. Okay. Uh, so you open the Salesforce app, and I'm just going to say that I just got out of Lakeland Regional Medical Center. So I'm going to go to the search and I'm gonna search for Lakeland. I already see it pop up, Lakeland Regional Medical Center. So pick the account. And looks like the Wi-Fi in the hospital here is not great. Oh, come on. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> should open quicker um, so you have your account open now you want to find your contacts and they move stuff around so you have to go to the bottom where it says details and you click on that and then you have to go down to the bottom again and you'll find contacts that was a horrible move it used to be at the top and now they put it at the bottom it's weird to get to but you can get to it it's down at the bottom contacts hit that and I'm just gonna pick Ashley right here at top. She is in the behavioral health unit, so that's your contact that I spoke with. Hit her, hit new task up top, and it will open up the screen to put the stuff in. So assign to me, that's um, auto-populated, and then go subject, uh, marketing is the typical one. Due date, uh, let's say it just happened today. Today's date pops up first. If you need to change the date, you can down here. Uh, priority normal, just leave that alone. Go to status, and you want to go to closed if it's something you've already done. If you haven't started yet and you're adding them ahead of time, you can go to not started. But closed, completed is what I'm gonna use. Then this one is super important. This was something they added a little while back, and if you don't put it in there, it does not show up at all. Um, so where it says name, you have to hit that box, and then again, pick Ashley from the top there. It'll always be the top one. Pick the person that matches, Ashley Behavioral Health Unit. Then you go down to here, uh, activity type, it was a face-to-face. -face. Uh, whatever it is, there's drop eyes in there, and phone calls, and emails. Pick what it is, I'm gonna pick face-to-face -face meeting, hit done, and then I go in the comments, and I will say, great talk with Ashley. Let them know we have open beds, uh, whatever your note is to put in there. I will just do that for now. Then if there's a next step, you can put a next step in there. Uh, typically, I just fill out the comments there with a with a short note and then hit done and then make sure you hit save you hit save boom you are done task marketing was created and you are all done it is added into Salesforce drive on to your next hospital all right hey great job and uh, let me know if there's any questions I just thought it'd be easiest to walk through on a video so thanks guys look forward to seeing y'all soon take care